So this is the sign that I saw a couple days ago that made me want to come over here and get this because I thought it looked tremendously gross. I think it looks amazing. Like I would have seen that and been like, I am eating that. What? And the thing that really caught my eye was this text down here, and it says that Japanese this people, approximately 80% of Japanese people, mana. Yeah, don't don't yet. This flavor don't haven't had this flavor yet. Don't understand this cheese cooking. <laughs> so it's like it's like 88% of, of Japanese people don't know about mac and, don't know what mac and cheese is. Yeah. <laughs> and I was like, all right, well, that sounds like it's going to be a I disaster. Mean, it totally <laughs> makes sense. Like they know about macaroni salad, but they don't know about the mac and mac cheese. Mac and cheese is and a whole new is, game. It's a whole new game for real. <laughs> So we're off to lunch, and if you have seen the thumbnail and the name, you probably already know what's going on, but Katie has not seen the thumbnail or the name because she has not, the video doesn't exist, is why. Because the video just started like three <laughs> seconds ago. And you have no idea where we're going, right? No idea. Do you have any? It's, it's in a sock sock. Yeah, okay. So, so That's it. I know I can walk there. <laughs> I was just thought it would be fun to get a blind taste test of something and to see what you think of it without having any, like, predisposed like guesses um, or you well, know what I mean? I just realized you've asked me to have a bandana ready, but what about hearing? Uh, we're gonna, I don't know, maybe we'll put, do you have your headphones? I have headphones. Okay, well maybe we'll put headphones in, I don't know, we'll see. But I, we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the bandana on, we're at the station right now, and then we're gonna go for a couple of blocks walk, or maybe five or six blocks, or maybe a couple of miles. You don't know, it's all a surprise. Yeah. And then we're going to somehow manage to get you to eat a thing without you having any, <laughs> <laughs> Any assumptions about what it is that you're eating? I'm turning all of my uh, stuff off. <laughs> Katie gets to walk down the street like this. It's gonna be. Did you bring your? Did you bring oh, your the, stick? The, the the girls wear the kimonos. I'm just wearing the uh, bandit outfit. Wrong. Can she see? Can you see like down here? Yeah, I can, can see. You can see your feet. But. That's probably I okay. I can't see my feet. I can see your feet. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, so I think that. But this... I'll also be putting my mask over top of this. Oh, good idea. So. Where are um, your ears, though? Oh uh, no, we might have to do it the other way around. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll I'll sort this out. All right. You look like you're really tucked in there. You can't see anything because of the mask. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what we're gonna do is um, I'm just gonna like walk and you just follow my voice. Will that work? Or no, should... <laughs> I'm standing here until until okay. something moves me. Okay. Well, the first thing we should do is spin you around a little bit so you lose any I idea know. of I what know. direction things are. <laughs> I don't want to be dizzy now. Eric, I get dizzy. <laughs> I'll so unwind easy. it. <laughs> I'll unwind it. You're good. I didn't take my motion meds. Okay. Are you for good? Are you ready to walk? Uh, I don't want to walk like that. Okay. It's too restricting. Like this? Yes. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, this is going to be a slow walk. Yeah, it's going to be a slow walk. I uh, have to trust. Oh, shit. I, I'm not, I won't walk you into anything crazy. You're true. really squeezing. I, I'm, I'm going to lose the blood circulation in my arm. This what is, are you doing down here? You're going to squeeze it. This is scary for me. Yeah, I bet it is. It's pretty, probably pretty wild. I keep thinking there's just going to be a column. You got enough, column, column, column. <laughs> <laughs> they, they just lined up the columns everywhere now. You're drifting in a weird way. Just walk straight. You're good. You're good. <laughs> I had to tell myself how you walk straight. Oh shit, there's stairs on it coming. Don't worry, I got it. I'll tell you. Just walk, you're good. <laughs> okay, okay, you got, so you got some steps. One, and then one more. And then one more. All right, we're good. You All have right. To double tap that step. <laughs> okay. You know where I am. Oh, do you? Yeah, the pop-up shop's right over there. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, then you might have to do some more spins. No. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna have a dirty mask if that happens. <laughs> All right. You can hear the beeping, right? Yeah. That's for that's for you. Street? Yeah. You look crazy. Girls are staring at you, by the way. I like don't doubt that. A, girl, a whole group of girls walk by to stare at you like, what the hell? <laughs> you doing better? Yeah, I don't know where we are anymore because Good. I don't really know that street very well. Yeah, I took kind of a weird turn too. Throw you off the scent. 
<laughs> All right, we've arrived to the outside of where we are going to be, and there's actually an advertisement of what we're going to be having behind you. Do you have any idea where you are or anything at all? I have an idea. I will not share it because I feel like it would ruin the excitement. Okay, that would be, that's fair. Maybe afterwards you can say if you got it right or not, okay? I could write it down. Does that sound good? <laughs> I trust you. You can just... <laughs> I was going to try to use my phone without my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so what I think we're going to do is I'm going to take you inside and sit you down and then I will work on getting us our food. Cool? Hold on. You're... I'm going to put these in. You just want to be completely sensory deprived? Well, I also don't want my suspicions to be confirmed based on anything other than what I've suspicioned already. Even if you figure out where you are, I don't think you're going to have any idea what you're going to eat. So I think we're still good. I guess that's kind of true. If that's the case, then should I say what I, where I think we are? Nah, just hold on to it. Okay. So no headphones? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It's up to you. I tangled them. How am I going to explain to you how to sit down if I can't talk? I think no headphones. I think you're getting over the top. Okay. <laughs> okay, so there she is. We've got the food item. There she is. We've got the Katie item. And now I'm looking at this and wondering how it is <laughs> that I'm going to convince you to eat this without just dumping it all over the ground. I smell ketchup. You smell ketchup? Something okay. like ketchup. Something okay. tomato-y. That's, I mean, maybe not completely wrong. Is the but, drink on this tray? Uh, the drink is safe. It's over by me, so don't worry. You're good. I moved it off the tray. So, that is safe. This has just kind of turned into an interesting experiment, to be honest. This is confirming where I think we are. Okay, where do you think we are? I believe we're at most burger. Okay, wow. I'm really impressed. How did you figure that out? Slight trajectory of the direction that we walked and the fact that there was something overhead. Uh, yeah, because it's in the underneath the train pass. Okay, so here's the situation. You have got a most burger in a package here. You can have a fry if you want one. I ate a fry. You couldn't tell though. So the mo this most burger is unique, to put it lightly. And I think it's gonna be fun to watch you learn what this is and guess what it is you're oh. eating. <laughs> so it's got the condom on it. Yeah, try not to eat try not to eat the condom. Does it have two condoms? I think it does, yes. Yeah. That's evil. <laughs> I don't know how to work with two condoms. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I usually try to pull this apart so that I can get more face space in the condom, but this, this is Fairly difficult to film, too. I'm just kind of, this is sort of a mess. Okay. Stop so. messing with my <laughs> shit. You can't see it. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Do you yeah. need to do B roll and shit? <laughs> hold, it, hold it like this. There you go. That looks real nice. Okay. So, <laughs> this is like, this looks like some like ISIS shit going on right now, though, to be honest with you. I'm feeling weird about this. What does ISIS eat? I watched them recently on the news and what they ate looked good. What? ISIS? Yeah, they were they were eating stuff off of a tray. It was rice and Oh, I stuff. think you're thinking of Al-Qaeda. It was like in Afghanistan, yeah. What does ISIS eat? <laughs> well, maybe they eat most burger. We're going to find out. So, uh, turn it towards your face hole. My t turn it turns my face hole. <laughs> and um, jump in and let's see if you can figure out what it is is going on. I'll probably pick the hardest thing to blindfold you to have eating. It might take you a few bites to get all the way into it. Lettuce is involved. Okay. Breading tomato um, sauce. It's like chicken marinara. Okay, interesting. Do I know exactly what this is? You've had all these items in your life at some point. See if you can determine how much you can get with just your taste buds. I can taste the breading, but not the actual meat. So I'm assuming it, or I'm thinking now that it might be fish. 
Ah, uh, okay. Interesting guess. But pairing... Something got spicy. Or mustardy. <laughs> <laughs> Croque. Okay, wow. So it's not meat. That's why I can't taste meat. What else have we got in here? Let me look at this. Is it is it falling apart? Is it turned into a nightmare? Is it pushed too far back? I don't know. I think just keep digging. Is it weird to eat a burger when you can't see it? Oh whoa, it's all falling apart now. Oh no. Critical mass. Do I need help? Um Yeah, kind of. Try to eat. See, I'm touching your hand. And you yeah. bring your hand like this direction <laughs> and kind of eat back this way. Or I'm sorry, your face. Put it up towards your face. How can I explain this situation? Okay, cool. Now, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat down so over there. So much condom in the way there. Eat down over there. <laughs> I got a leaf. <laughs> Go a little deeper in that little corner over there. There's some sort of karashi. Karashi is like a spicy mustard. This is ace footage. <laughs> Top notch content. Can I get a napkin? Yes. Um, what fell in your lap? A whole lot of stuff. <laughs> Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Oh no. Can we take a break? Yeah. Because I need a break <laughs> from this moment. <laughs> so this is what fell. And it's not a big deal. It's just a little bit of lettuce and some bread. She didn't miss any of the main ingredients or anything that <laughs> <laughs> it just hit your lap, right? Yeah, I think my mask was down there, though. Yeah, I think it landed on your mask. <laughs> so, it's um, <laughs> but it's not that big of a mess. And I'm not going to say that you have missed uh, on a days of eating like an adult. This is high level challenge here. Yeah. So um, what you've got in your hands Burn. right now is basically an open face sandwich. So don't t touch the top and you can just go ahead and eat what you've got. And hopefully you're going to figure out a little more about what it is you're having. That's much less of a disaster. We should have done this from the start. <laughs> okay. Wasabi is probably involved. Okay, interesting. And that is the, or, there's a smell of like karashi or wasabi chilling in there. Mm, yeah, and it, it strikes your tongue really, Violently. You found anything else? Wasabi and like tartar sauce. Hmm. Bit of a relish kind of feel. Where'd the tomato go? <laughs> was there ever a tomato? I don't know if there was. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I'm going to say that at this point, I kind of want to enjoy what I'm eating. I don't want to get to the end of it. And not know anything at and all? And not know. Like, okay. I don't want to, I want to open my eyes and see the item, not have an empty set of hands. What the fuck is this? <laughs> I'm really glad that I didn't let me hearing you order change my thoughts. <laughs> So is that mac and cheese? Yeah. I somewhat heard you say like some sort of mac and blah blah and uh, I was just like uh and then I just started I immediately plugged my ears and started humming and I was like there's no way you heard the right thing like mac and cheese can't be the answer to this. What do you think of this? Why does it taste? Good. You think it's good? Yeah. Yeah. I thought it looked Yeah, so the, the, the tomato looks, might be down there. Hold on a second. It's, it's very much like something my mom would make. My mom used to make a macaroni cheese and tomatoes. And I never thought about putting karaoke in on that, but I will seriously go home and at some point be like, we're gonna make something that you can get in America, but you're gonna have to learn how to deep, or you can get in Japan, but we're gonna have to learn how to deep fry it. And I think, my mom would be very excited. What do you but think? she would be weirded out. If she ate it in this restaurant, she'd be weirded out by it. But if I let her make it, it'll be fine. How do you feel about the quality of the cheese and the mac and all that stuff? Like, 
Just eat it with your fingers uh, at this point. <laughs> The macaroni feels a little bit overcooked or like it has been sitting somewhere waiting to be served for a while. Yeah. But the fact that you get the crunch from the, uh, from the croque is fine. Um, so should I go over there and order myself one of these things? Yeah. Yeah, it's good? Yeah. Okay, I will. I would say this is, I'm happy. I came here thinking I might be eating something that I'm gonna end up at the end, like being like that took a whole lunch. But you know, it was <laughs> worth it to try something weird. This I'm very happy with what I've opened my eyes to. This I, I'm ready to eat the rest of it, and I got some French fries. Most of our French fries are not that good. They're thicker, but that's not a good French fry. I'm gonna try another one. <laughs> What's not? They have like dark meat potatoes and like uh, white meat. Dark meat. Dark meat potatoes. Meat. Meat. potatoes don't have meat, bro. I know, but <laughs> that one tasted like uh, like the dark side of the spud. <laughs> I don't know how to explain. And then I picked this one up and I was like, mm, probably a light meat potato. <laughs> Okay, because the way that Katie got to eat this burger was a little bit chaotic, I thought I'd give like a more standard explanation as to what we're working with. Um, it is this normal Mosburger bun, and then on the inside, you've got kind of a disgusting looking mixture of mustard, a pasta sauce that we would call a meat sauce here, but we couldn't decide what that was called in English. It's like a pasta sauce with little pieces of beef in it basically, right? That's how you describe it. There's another word for it we can't think of and then the mac and cheese which is what this is being branded after and it is a little bit underwhelming in that sense for the mac and cheese in my in my opinion it needs um, a firmer noodle it needs a firmer noodle yeah it just feels like it was cooked kind of meh and then a croque um patty which is like potato yep potato that's been breaded and deep fried potato that's been breaded and deep fried and then a little bit of lettuce it's fairly simple oh and then a spicy mustard which is where most of the experience is coming from. It's got a lot of kick, and I can see why you thought um, wasabi, because it's got that kind of like burn in the nose type of flavor, and if you were blindfolded, it might be kind of hard to tell the difference between two of those things, which you had going on. Um, I actually thought it was gonna be horrible. Like, when I saw the ad, I was like, mac and cheese and mustard, and like, as it's like, it's not gonna work, but actually okay um i would say this is one of the better most burgers burgers that i've had not that i eat here all the time or anything but i'm not a big fan of the place generally but this one is actually kind suck. of a cool experience the, the fries suck okay he's, he's shit on the fries yeah the fries are kind of a bummer she's like these are freezer fries <laughs> but yeah that's uh that's the most burger what it was it branded as the mac and cheese croquet bugger <laughs> no, that's the that's their that's our review of it and uh, I hope you enjoyed watching Katie <laughs> try to eat it blindfolded because that was um, quite an experience. How did you, you feel? You didn't have a blindfold on and you dropped it. I did. I dropped it right before we started filming this. So oh, you have not achieved eating like an adult today. But I caught it with the other hand. That doesn't matter. You were in your lap. You, you I had to wash your hand for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Make sure to hit the like button and leave us a comment about anything at all as a sacrifice to the altar of the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe for more burgers and stuff, and check us out on Twitch for video games in real life. Linked below.